Today we're going to go ahead and talk about note taking skills, techniques, and so what we're going to be discussing are, are just different ways for to help yourself be able to take some good notes. The important thing about taking notes is that you have to be prepared. And by pre preparation, we mean that you know you have to be ready to take notes um, as soon as you walk into the classroom. We do want you to be prepared and we do want you to have, you know, have a, a notebook or have different notebooks, you know, have a notebook for each class that you have, or if you have a very thick notebook, um, try to get some tabs and separate those sections so that way you're organized and you know where to write your notes depending on which class you have. So being prepared is key. And by being prepared, that also means that, um, you know, you might want to read your chapters beforehand, before you come into class. That way you're not going in there not knowing anything. So if you read those chapters beforehand, at least you'll have an idea of what's going on in class. Also, if the instructor provides uh, notes already or PowerPoint slides, print those off beforehand. So that way you can kind of stay, follow the presentations and fill it, fill it in with your own notes. That's also very important. So. Um, once you come into class, the important thing is to not write down everything. Once you're listening to the lecture, you want to go ahead and just, you know, write, uh, listen for the main concepts and the main ideas. That's the most important thing. So do not try to write everything down. Just listen to what the instructor is saying and write those main concepts and ideas down. And, um, you know, leave some, some spaces there while you're writing notes to come back and fill those in. So the key thing is to, to listen for those, those main ideas. And um, I, there's no right or wrong way to write notes. So whatever works for you, you know, keep using that. If, if, if you're good at taking notes, then that's good for you. If you don't know how to take notes, then um, try different ways or different methods until you figure out a method that works best for you. Um, here I have this, this, this method here is called the Cornell system and the Cornell system, there is paper called Cornell paper that you can buy which is already prepared for you. If not, you can use regular paper and just draw lines that are similar to that. Leave a little bit of space here on your left hand side because you'll be using that. And so the main thing is to write down at the very top is just, you know, your class, maybe your dates, and then what subjects you're discussing that day. And then under where it says, under the notes section, that's where you're going to write the, the majority of your notes. You know, that's where you're writing down your main concepts, your ideas, and that's where you're going to be doing that. When, at the end, when you're done taking notes, you're going to come to this side, which is your cue side, and here you can go ahead and, and write out your questions. Questions that you think might be on the exam or just summarizations of key things. So for example, if we're talking about the Civil War here, three causes of the Civil War, on this side you can say, what are the three causes of the Civil War? So when you do study, you can just cover this up and say, what are the three causes of the Civil War? Try to guess those. And then you can look at your answers and that way you know, hey, I got those right, I know what they are, or you can just keep studying that until you, until you get them right, okay? Down here you'll write your summary. But this is just a quick way, easy way to take some notes. And uh, that's pretty much it. So just, oh, once you're done taking notes, the most important thing is to make sure that you go back after you've done those. Uh, you know, once you're done with your classes, is to study. So if you're taking notes, it's very important to study those every day. So. You should be reviewing your notes, you should be studying your notes, get ready for that exam. Do not write your notes down and just leave them there because that's not going to do you any good. So, thank you.